Hi, I'm Dr. Jean Cirillo. I'm a practicing psychologist in New York, and today we're going to talk about high school psychology experiments. Now we can make up some really interesting game-like experiments that will still teach students about psychology. One of the first ones would be following instructions. For this, you'll need a well-trafficked area in the halls in the high school and a video camera that's not too conspicuous, but that can film the area. Then you get either a cardboard or a wooden box, put a cover on it, and write clearly on top of the cover, do not open. And let the camera record every time a child or a teacher opens up the box. And this will probably give you some good insight into gender and instruction following. It will certainly be very interesting and a lot of fun for the students to, in effect, catch somebody else opening the box. Another thing would be a good experiment on conformity. Take a group of students and tell them that you're going to give them times tables and you want them all to say the wrong answer. Let's say it's 4 times 5, say 25 instead of 20. And then get another student in who's not part of uh, the original group. And you might find that that student, once he or she hears the others say a certain answer, is very likely to conform. Once that happens, Everybody can let them in on the joke, and that can certainly open up discussions about conformity. Another good experiment is to get some soda that's clear, like a lemon and lime, something that you could put food coloring in. And you take that flavor and you put orange food coloring in one, cherry, grape, and then you have the students taste the same soda, not knowing that they put the food coloring and not seeing the food coloring, and say what flavor was the soda. And this is where we'll talk about how our perception can affect your senses, that the soda that's purple really tastes great, the orange tastes orange, and they're really all the same. All right, so those are three good experiments for high school psychology to make the class fun for the teacher and the students. I'm Dr. Jean Cirillo. I'm a practicing psychologist in New York.